Lund Solar Systems LS60T HA. Uh, there's a 50 version, a few other different versions. It's quite an aerial symbol, serial number on this. Uh, it's a solar telescope specifically for that task. Uh, seems to be a common problem with the prism section. Uh, this is the B1200. Um, I should have really took a picture before. Um, but the fault seems to be with the filter. This is a glass filter. It's not coated. It's actual glass. And it drops inside there, which is that one there. Um, frosting or rusting. Um, I'll try and put a picture on later of what it looked like before. But I was recommended on eBay. Not eBay, sorry. I bought it on eBay. It's recommended with a Google search to buy this product to clean it. And it was particularly bad. It got to the point where I couldn't even see through the grass or focus. Um, two minutes of this rubbing this against this cloth with a little bit of that on, and it is now, I would say, perfectly clear. If you just, if I sh can get the picture to come up from previously, it was totally frosted over. Um, it does seem to be a compromise with the very early ones. I've contacted Lunt about it. They don't seem interested. Uh, I've even been in the UK after to cover the postage for a replacement and that and still they don't seem interested so I've just gone ahead and done it myself. Something else to gain access. Uh, this ring here, it's got four small indents in it. Uh, uh, something like these or a long nose pair of pliers. It's not particularly tight in there. Uh, we'll do the job. There's normally a small amount of silicon just in one place. Just scratch that off first to make the removal of the ring simple. Um, you need to remove this part first, but that just threads onto there. It just basically screws off, no problem at all to get it off. Um, and then obviously the lens will then just drop out this way. Um, give it a clean with this. And it seems to be pretty fine. Um, there's no coating on the glass, I believe. It is the glass so that you're not going to wear anything away so obviously being a solar telescope the first thing you want to do is mess with something that's going to damage your eyes um, so I did google it first and it's not a coating it's actually the glass so it seemed to be the contamination whatever was on it uh, seemed to be growing on the glass uh, uh, small clean with this seems to have done the job well I'll put it back together simply drop that back in put the ring on Screw that back on, it should be up and running again. Uh, thanks a lot for all your help.